Hey, this is Wisp of Vegetate, and I was reading on Facebook today about how some people can use a tuning fork to help pollinate their plants. Well, if you know from our past videos, we use we usually use electric toothbrush. So I thought this would be an interesting fact. You can get these online on eBay for about four dollars and fifty cents. Uh, I'll have a link in the description below. Make sure you get the right size one, uh, and uh, I'll explain to you why later. But let me show you how I think you're supposed to use it. And I think you're supposed to do. Yeah, no, it's not work it. Nothing on the internet ever works. Daddy, let me, Daddy, let me show you how it's really done. Oh, okay. <laughs> Pollen came from that. I saw it. Yep. Oh, there's the powder. Oh, so that's how you do it. Is that how you do it, Zoe? Yes. Does it work? Yes. Any pollen coming out? No pollen coming out, and it left toothpaste on me. <laughs> There's toothpaste on the plant! So, in conclusion, do I think the tuning fork works better than the electric toothbrush? Uh, yes, uh, tremendously. Uh, now, you better be careful with these little teeth right here on this weight. It'll actually, t it so vibrates so much that it will actually tear up the uh, tomato plant a little bit on the flesh. Uh, it, this still does work great. We've used it for a few years, but this is way more superior. Again, 450 cents, you can leave it outside. You let it get rained on. It's not going to tear up like the toothbrush will. That's what happened to all of our toothbrushes after time. I just basically go grab one of the kids' old toothbrushes and buy them a new one. So, uh, be aware though, when you do buy a tuning fork, it's very important that you buy the right one. If you buy one like this, be careful, it will not work. As soon as you hit it, it works like a tuning fork, but as soon as it touches anything, very lightly, it stops vibrating. This right here, you can hit and it'll vibrate forever. And you should be able to hear it. To see, uh, you, you can get different sizes and different uh, frequencies. The supposedly what I was reading on online says that the C is the best. But then again, like I said, I'm not an expert at this. It's just our opinion with something we found. Well, we were really truly amazed with how well it turned out. A B. Okay. <gasps> and bees vibrate on that's why they and and when we hit it on here and it hit on and put it on the plant it made the buzzing noise like a bee mm -hmm. so i mean and that means what, that's what the bees do right they collect the pollen they vibrate they, the pollen they They're, vibrate yep and then when they touch their they touch their bottoms on the thing, and then it start, and then all the pollen comes out. Exactly, that's what we're doing. We're imitating nature. If you don't have a lot of bees and you want to get better yields, you can make your own tuning fork. Oh, that's kind of cool. Ooh. Tuning fork. Don't cross the streams. Hey guys, we're getting appreciate that thumbs up, and if you're new to our channel, please subscribe. And again, as always, it grows things. See ya. Ooh, up.